What's up everyone? Welcome back to One Strange Adventure. I'm Harold Strange and welcome to the next video. In today's video, we're going to talk a little bit about making sure our RV is ready to go when we get the green light for camping. First thing we want to do is go ahead and check the batteries. If you pulled them out uh, for winter storage, then you want to check them. They will still lose a charge while they're in storage. Uh, you may want to charge them, trickle charge them, or even add distilled water if necessary. You want to reinstall those, make sure all the connections are clean, and that you are getting power to the RV. Number two on the list is taking care of the water system. You want to get all that antifreeze out of the lines. You want to sanitize it and you want to open it up and make sure that you are getting good, clean, fresh water before you go on your camping trip. Number three is pretty important. Check the plumbing. This is an opportunity to check it in a controlled area and make sure that you have stores around you that can provide you materials if you have a water leak. A good way of checking it is actually to um, fill up the, the fresh tank and turn on the pump and what will happen is the pump will pressurize the lines and you should hear the pump turn off if the pump turns on again that means that it's losing water or it's losing pressure somewhere within the lines and you may want to check for a leak check your propane make sure that the tanks are topped off make sure that the lines are working properly that your uh, stove and your oven will turn on uh, if you have an RV refrigerator that runs off of propane when the electric is turned off. Go ahead and kick that on, make sure that it's working appropriately. And then that way, if something isn't, you can uh, you have a little bit of time to call someone in to help you out. Next on the list is making sure you check your tires. You wanna check the sidewalls to see if there's any cracking on it. Uh, in addition, you wanna check the air pressure, of course and make sure that they are inflated to the proper pressure. All right, next on the list is the seams in the sealant. You wanna walk around the RV, inspect all of the seals, uh, get up on the roof, look at all those seams. If you see any cracking, you may want to address that. Uh, in addition to that, I like to condition the uh, rubber seals that go around the slide outs to make sure that they are working properly and they are providing a nice tight seal for when we go camping. All right, so last on the list is making sure you inspect your safety equipment. Take a look at the fire extinguisher, replace it if you need to. Uh, same with the smoke detectors and the carbon monoxide detectors. Uh, you want to make sure for peace of mind you have proper working uh, safety equipment on board. All right, everyone. Well, that that's it. That's the list that we're going to work through ourselves. I hope that was helpful for you, uh, making sure that our RVs and campers are ready to go when we take them out of quarantine. I mean, storage. And so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you smash that like button. If you really liked the video, make sure you subscribe. And until the next strange adventure, keep making your own. Wait a minute. We can't in quite yet because there's one bonus tip uh, and one that I should have remembered um, when I stuck my hand in the propane compartment. Wasps are attracted to propane. I'm just going to leave it at that. Make sure you check it before you stick your hand in there.